use the smoke box with the beehive. I've okay. got nothing to light the fuel with. Oh, for crying out loud. Playing games every day, get set to watch Zenvius. G'day all, I'm Zenvius and we are playing Simon the Sorcerer with a walkthrough as needed. Unfortunately, last episode I had to use a lot of walking through to get through things, but hopefully now we'll get things together. So, I do have an idea with the sleeping giant though. Because we did just get our gigantic instrument. Maybe this, oh yes it's working, might wake him up. Well, annoy him up. Oh yep. Sweet. Okay. We have a drawbridge. Onwards. And I figured that one out on my own. Okay. You don't just have to rely on walkthroughs. You're, you're still getting closer and closer to Sordid's lair, I believe, by all these statues. A miniature statue. Probably a halfling. All right. What do we got around here? It's a... Uh, ooh. A sign. Let's look at the sign. Read all everything we can find. It says, warning, spontaneously combustible substance. Oh. All right. I want some of it. Give me. Oh. Ah. Uh, My I God. see. It's a real dragon. Indeed. Well, what did you expect in a dragon's cave? Well, I don't... This isn't happening. Aha. Uh -huh. I wouldn't hang about if I were you. I've got a fearful cold and consequent I not fully in control of don't worry. my breath. Don't worry. I have a solution for you then, sir. All right. And one second. I have. Where? Where is it? Oh. Oh, he's about to sneeze on me. Oh. Ooh. Vicious. Okay. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Just a tad scorched. Oh. First death. Nope. Nope. Indestructible. We can survive an Iron Maiden. Underwear. We can, oh, <laughs> just uh, just keep take it off eventually. You don't want those uh, cancer cells taking over. Okay. Oh, oh, we'll we'll stay out here and do it. Okay, see. Go fetch. That do it for you. Are we good? Hello, uh, chat to Mr. Dragon. I want the fire extinguisher. Wake up, Mr. Dragon. What the hell am I doing? I don't know. I don't want to wake him. I guess that is a valid point. Let's, let's pick up this fire extinguisher. And while we're at it, we'll get some gold. I'm going past him. If Why he not? Wakes up, I'll be toast again. Well, it should, we need money I'm for the shop. I'm past him. If he wakes up, I'll be toast again. Oh, fine. Okay, um... We'll head back in here. And we'll get back out here. What's up this way? Maybe there's more things to discover. My, that's an interesting rock. Indeed. What is it? Um, anything to click on around here? No? All right, uh, can I walk over here? Looks like I can. All right. Onwards, more exploration. More things to discover. And we have found climbing pins, apparently. All right, let's climb the climbing pins. Just stretch your leg out, buddy. There's a pin missing. Um, can I use the rat bone for where it's missing? That doesn't work. Okay, I guess we need some wood for it, maybe. We've got this hacksaw and a fire extinguisher and a more pile of things. Uh, oh, could I use the ladder, like lay it out over that the doesn't climb pins? Work. No, this ladder's still doing nothing. The icy ledge, can I use the ledge? Oh, I can. Okay, more things to explore. Onwards. And we have more frozen freaky statues. Eh, it's another day. Moving on. What else we got to find? Ooh, a pink splodge. Let's pick up the pink splodge. This tree does not look friendly, but I want the splodge. How am I supposed to pick up a splat of paint? Oh. Um, do we... No, but apparently this... Oh, the splodge will do something. All right, well... We'll teleport back out of here. Use the map. We have unlocked the dragon's cave, so that is a thing. Now, we have to figure out what we are going to do about this. Right. So, apparently we are meant to get money from the dragon's cave, but apparently we need a few more things before we do that. Let me see. Um... Let me see... Tiny thing! 
thing. Very, very tiny, misplaceable, ignorable element of this game, which I will show you if you go into the tavern, where we began at the start of the whole game, on top of the fruit machine is a box of matches. And I need that to light the smoke box. And that is what I have been needing to get for the last two and a half episodes. <laughs> well, we've got them now, right? Let's head on back. Let's get this puzzle done. Let's move on. And hopefully we'll get some progress finally happening in this game. Look, I do love point and click adventures, but I, I am preferring the newer stuff when this, this nonsense of, you know, miss one item, which was like two pixels long can be easily ignored, and if you miss it, you can't do anything. Uh, please give me that space bar where you can just, you know, pop up everything you can interact with. Okay, now we got it. We have the matches. We'll use the matches with the smoke box. Oh, and he'll walk straight over to the beehive, will he? And he'll put that together. And he'll, yes. And he'll put on his hat. And then he'll light the smoke box. Ah, oh, right. Now. Oh, and you'll have a ciggy while he's at it. Right. Q. Don't smoke, kids. Let's pick up some uh, wax. Okay. I took some beeswax from the hive. Yeah. Not entirely sure why. Okay, apparently we go back to the pub. Then we are meant to use this wax in the tavern somehow. You know, I'm just going to give up on trying to solve this, and I'm just going to go through this walkthrough. We're going to finish this game. Look, I love this game, and thank you so much to Sokom for telling me to do it, and I, I want to experience it. I want to know the story, and the jokes are funny. I just... I I'm getting fed up. <laughs> I'm going to finish this game. We're going to move on, we're going to get through it, and we're going to finish it, and we're going to get on to something fun, like Simon Sorcerer 2, which will probably be just as frustrating. And as always, I'm, I'm so glad I don't have any hair because I would be tearing it out over this damn thing. Right, into the tavern. Talk to the barman. Hello again. Yeah. And apparently we need to ask him for a drink. I'd like a wet wizard, please. Hang on a moment. And while he's doing that, I'm apparently used the wax on a beer barrel. I'm sure I've got some sparrow juice down here somewhere. And, uh, uh, well, what are we doing? Okay, so we've waxed up the I barrel. I the nozzle on the barrel with the wax. Oh, uh, so now it'll be appear empty, I'm guessing? Because when he I'm turns sorry, it, sir, nothing will come out. I'm sorry, sir, I can't seem to find any sparrow juice okay. at the moment. That's okay, I'm underage anyway. <laughs> oh, I see, and you try and... Wait here, kid, right. I've got something for you. Okay. Also, he takes that barrel out. So... I'm guessing now because we've still got a that they still got beer in it. Hey, kid, take mm -hmm. one of these leaflets home to your dad. Oh, okay. I have a leaflet now. Happy hour at the drunken druid. Mm. Ale for one gold piece a mug. There's also a free beer voucher attached. Oh, nice, handy. All right, we'll, we'll get out of here. Move on. I, I do feel sorry for this dwarf. I wish I could give him back his beard. Now we will pick up this barrel of beer. A barrel of beer, beer barrel. Good now that we have hat. that, we have to go back to the dwarf mine. Apparently, we're going to get him blasted. All right, we'll go back to the center of the forest, and up. yeah, apparently this rock. That again, that is completely ignorable. If you miss it, you can't proceed. You've got to pick up the rock because apparently under this is the password. Oh look, there's a word written on it. Uh huh. And let's see what that word is. Let's have a look, a look at the word. It has the word beer chalked on it. Really? Okay, well, now we're back to the dwarves. We will wear this beard. Wow, very sophisticated. Mm -hmm. Itchy, though. All right, now we will head on back in here. Now we have the password, and maybe we can finally get this All mirth right, roll. Right. All right, what's the password, then? All right, it is beer. Is it beer? You may pass. Right oh, on. Wow. Cool. Okay. So here we are with the dwarves. All right. Let's have a chat to them. Let's. Maybe we can figure this puzzle out without doing anything. Watch your fellow dwarf. Go away. I'm busy. Okay. Uh. Oh. What's rattled your cage? Indeed. You. Oh. Now go away. 
Not very happy, is he? I'm an inspector from head office. I'm here for Where's Dwarf Inquisition. Um, I've left it at home. Leave me alone. Hmm. All right, he's not very friendly. Talk to this one then. Excuse me. Hello. Huh. Wow, heavy sleeper. Indeed. Mm. All right, what are we meant to do with that? Let's see. We are so we're here now. We are meant to mm, you talk to the dwarf in the middle of the screen and then use the key in the door. Let's see what he talking. I'm just going to explore this cave for a little Stop. bit. Oh, God, get oh. rid of him. Oh wow. Oh wow, he just jumps straight to attention there. Duty dwarves only. Okay, 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 okay. Um, I, 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 I am a duty I dwarf. I am a duty dwarf. Yes. No, you're not. Oh. Fair enough. So <laughs> not for. Well, I tried. But I'm standing in for Axe Face Skull Splitter. Why? What's wrong with him? Uh, um, uh. He was caught short, I'm afraid. But up, Ching. I don't believe you. Fair enough. So not for. Oh, all right. That's okay. I'm not a dwarf. Indeed. What? I said, um, I come from the north. Oh. <laughs> hey, just naff off, will you? you we just got to go through all this. Naff off yourself. Yeah. Ow. Ow. That's not very nice at all. All right. So, okay. So, we can't explore. So, talk to the, use the key in his door. I don't see what he's, oh, so I've got to get past him. Do I? All right. What if I go down here? Anything of interest down this way? Oh, okay, here's some drunken dwarves. And more barrels. Alright, let's uh, let's chat to this one. Maybe he's a little happier. If not, we'll just give him more beer. <laughs> he looks drunk. Indeed. He probably couldn't tell his ass from his elbow. Well, uh, give him more beer. I don't think he'd find any use for it. Oh, okay. Well, I assume this was where I meant to be, but no. Okay. Head on back. So. Head back. All right. So give the barrel to the dwarf on the left. I see. Okay. So I meant to give that beer to the dwarf on guard. So give beer dwarf. Care for some beer by any chance? I'm oh, on duty. He's happy with but that. I suppose one mag can't hurt. Yeah, just one or a keg or a storeroom. Bring it down, will you? Okie dokie. <laughs> this way. Okay. Let's see what happens. Bring it over here. Right, right, right. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. We'll get this together. All right. Here's the keg. Now, how about a drinking competition? Ooh. Uh. <laughs> you, will, you, you guys enjoy that. I'm, I'm gonna head back to where the place apparently I was meant to be. You were meant to be guarding was. And we'll head on down this way. Can I take his spear? No, I cannot. But I'm going to head this way. And if you get pissed off about guard, it... Guard! Eh. Time for a sharp exit. No guard. Where is that lazy do, 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 He must do, 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 have gone beer break. Hi-ho, hi-ho, it's up to us we go. La-la-la-la-la-la-la-la-la. Right, we'll grab this hook. Uh, oh, we got a... Oh, can I use this with the rope? seems obvious. No, right, use work. rope with hook. No. That okay. doesn't work. That doesn't do anything. There's ladders I here. Or could I use my go. ladder maybe? La, 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 Let me see. La, 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 la. Um, he said Shut that the guy's probably drunk. Where... I ho, in, I ho, in the in the other room. Go. So la, 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 we will go la, la, down to there. I ho, I ho, I ho. Shut, shut. Once we get through this, then we go down here. And once we're down here, we'll look at all the damn dwarves, and maybe we can find a key. Ah, uh, this is just embarrassing. Okay, look at this dwarf. Do you have a key on you? He seems to be in a drunken stupor. Okay, look at dwarf. He seems to be in a drunken stupor. Alright, look at this dwarf. He looks very drunk. Um, remember, is there something Anyone I meant for a bit? to do here that I'm not... Let, let's talk to these two chaps. Maybe there's something I can find. He looks drunk. No, he's drunk. He couldn't tell his ass from his elbow. Okay, talk to the other one. No, no, so neither of them, same thing. He looks drunk. Same thing. He probably couldn't tell his ass from his elbow. Alright, let's see. Um, troll is disposed of. Return to the thing. Do the thing <laughs> with the thing. 
Go down the right step, stone walls. Use the feather on the one who's on the floor. Oh, all right. Use feather on the one on the floor. Okay, here we go. Ugh. Sometimes I think people torture me with their choices of recommended games, but hey, I'm having fun, why not? I'll get this key. Now we have a key. Now we go to the treasury. And then we will get the game moving forward. Moving, moving forward. Moving on. Going down the stairs. He'll complain about the lack of guards again, but that's okay, because I do not care. God. We're going Time down the stairs. We'll do a Where short exit. Walking slug. down the stairs. Must have gone going down this break. way. Going along. Going over this way. Gonna use the key. Gonna use the right key. Gonna use the correct hold, key. Use I the key hold. on the door. The door is now open. We go in the door. For some reason, we keep the key, even though it's probably never going to be used again. And we really should have thrown it away. Oh. Oi, get out of here. This is restricted area. Yeah, cool, whatever. All right, so here. Yeah. I've come to make you an offer. Indeed. Really? What sort of an offer? Uh, one that you can't refuse. Maybe, um... You may have already won one million gold pieces. He were being really? May. Uh, well... Clear off! I'm trying to guard these gens, and you're distracting me. Alright, <laughs> fine, fine. Okay, he's not very happy, is he? Okay, um, so give be a voucher to door. That's just plain silly. Okay, open door. I can't seem to get. He doesn't give me a chance to talk to him about this thing. Okay, sure, sure. then we give the beer voucher to the doorway. Oh, oh, oh. Is that I gonna do it? I told you to go away. Oh, I think we're gonna do it. Okay. Um. A temporary miscalculation on your yes. part. Yes. Why? Because I've come to make you a once-in-a-lifetime offer. Beer. What sort of an offer? Beer voucher. Uh. Um. Oh yes. I've got something in my inventory that you want. What's that then? You well... want my beer voucher. There What's we this? go. Happy out the drunken druid. Heck and yes. A free voucher. How can I ever repay you? Oh. <laughs> um. Nice pile of gems you got there. Nice pile of gems you got there. Yeah. Just one though. All right. No, no, no. I think that's reasonable. You know, I just gave you a piece of paper. I think it's fair exchange. Something to justify all my going back and forth, back and forth, trying to figure out how this damn puzzle gets unlocked. All right. But hey, got a gem. Got another thing. <laughs> Fantastic! Now, we'll take this. Here you are. Now, clear off. And we will get out of here. And we will leave it at there for this episode. And Thank you out. again for watching Simon the Sorcerer and my mind-numbing adventure of trying to solve all these puzzles. So, once again, thank sure, you. Sure. I will talk to you in the next episode. I'm Xenvius, and you can enjoy your I know, day. I know. It's up to where we go. La, 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 la.